What is going on, everybody? Welcome to episode f- three of Supernatural. Our last episode was about wing dingoes. Uh, yeah, so um, I thought it was okay, a pretty mid episode, but overall, it's just continuing on the story. Uh, some episodes are going to be better than others. It is what it is. But uh, as I mentioned before, I do read comments. I do read the comments that you guys post and feature them in the videos. However, I normally record two to three of these videos at the same time. So uh, I unfortunately for this episode is not going to have any new comments to give to you guys. But next, the following episode should have a few comments I can read off from you guys. So if you have any insightful tips or uh, just trivia about the show conversation down below as well as your overall grading and rank of this episode in the conversation down below because as i mentioned in the last towards the end of the last episode i know most people don't stick around to the end uh i gave it an overall of a c uh which by the way you should stick to the end because i tell you guys how i feel about the episode and i grade it but uh anyway uh, overall c so i would like to see how you guys how I would want to see how you guys feel about this episode. I hit the microphone for a second uh, because, um, yeah, so, uh, certain people think the episodes are bad. Some people think they're good. I want to see how my uh, thoughts and opinions of the show differ from your guys'. Uh, maybe you guys were thinking the same thing as I was. Maybe you guys think the last episode was an amazing episode. Uh, that's for you just uh to get a little viewer engagement for you guys um and uh yeah we're going to episode three uh dead in the water uh i was informed these uh some of these titles aren't going to be too spoilery so it's fine if i accidentally read them it's whatever uh and uh yeah with that being said we're about to just jump right into it get early access for five dollars over on patreon as well as you get episode one of each season and opener for free head over now to the discord the link will be in the supernatural channel on the discord to the episode or the full length episode of me reacting to supernatural as well as any other episode ones for um various other shows that i'm reacting to once upon a time one piece pretty little liars doctor who what has you uh be sure to go ahead and check it out but with that being said we about to just jump into episode three of supernatural yeah well girls don't like guys who still live at home <laughs> what what does that mean guys that still live at home oh i guess they're like parents house i will okay guys still like buff girls okay i don't even know what that meant This show specifically has like this weird fil grainy filter that I'm not sure if I like. Like this weird color saturation and like there's a like a grainy filter over it as well. But the graininess could be to the uh the upscale of the resolution. I don't know, maybe. Okay, girl got pulled underwater. And she was never heard from again. Funeral? Yeah, it's weird. They buried an empty coffin for uh, a closure or whatever. Okay, sure. Closure. I mean, that's understandable. Like, but if you can't find the body, you just assume that they're missing and not dead. Okay. U.S. Wildlife, what does that have to... Again, like, I'm kind of weirded out that they're like, let's hurry up and bury them. Or, uh, do a funeral. Yeah, she was a varsity swimmer. She fact, we grew up in that lake. Did somebody see her drown? She's as safe out there as in her own bathtub. So, no splash. I mean, that's just no factually not true. Oh. oh, well, hey there. What's your name? Oh, creepy kid. The kid's in on it. He's, he's doing something. Like I said, two blocks. Thanks. Must be hard with your sense of direction. Never being able to find your way to a decent pickup line. Damn. Enjoy your stay. She owned them. Drop the fucking mic. Didn't even like kids. I love kids. Name three children that you even know. Ew, don't. 
Name three children in general. I'm thinking. I you to know that I will. You don't even have to say anything. You can draw me a picture. Because it was a mermaid. What's your dad? A lake. siren dragged his ass to the bottom of the sea. I'm trying to guess what the monster is. When I think about what Lucas went through, what he saw. Kids are strong. You'd be surprised what they can deal with. They can deal with their mother you being know, flipped upside down and burned alive. Such life as army men. What and normal like, kids do, just minus the talking. Sweetie? Honestly, he's a perfect child. Thanks. Yo, that's Thanks. actually a sick ass drawing. The shading and everything. Maybe there's a hint in that drawing. And then this is where I stand away from the water. Yep, I'm leaving. I'm moving to Arizona. Dad, it's something. No, you never. For one is brown and dark and nasty. <gasps> you deserve this. Sir. Shit, I would break that. And the father is just like not hearing any of this. This is the loudest thing ever. Well. This body ain't disappearing. In a few months, whatever this thing is, whatever it wants, it's running out of time. And if it can get through the pipes, it can get to anyone, almost anywhere. Even this us. Again, so we never, we can't take a shower ever. Huh. Well, maybe Bill's not the only one who knows something. Ooh, okay. That house looks nothing like that cabin. For one, is green. Where's the green at? I'm Where's sorry. the green at, Lucas? I just need to Gonna draw something. Things. Draw it accurate. I need your help again. Maybe it's just me, but I didn't draw this like random stuff. I drew like Power Rangers and like stories and shit. I didn't just draw a bicycle. Church? But there's less than a thousand of those around here. Oh, college boy thinks he's so what? smart. What? That's a huge, like, landmark that's in front of the house. You use context clues, Dean. You don't have to be smart to understand that, hey, you know, the house may be common, but maybe what's next to it isn't. What you said about mom. Okay. What if the, the dad did something to the kid, killed him, and then the kids get revenge by killing his kids. I figured it all out. I'm a fucking genius. Sweeney vanishes, and this is all connected to Bill Carlton somehow. Yeah, Bill okay. Shows he's behind but what about and um? The people he loves, they're all getting punished. So what if Bill did something to Peter? What if Bill killed him? Yeah, Peter's spirit would be furious. It won't revenge. It's possible. So, Bill Mr. drowned Peter. His body somewhere in the ocean. That's hey, why check it out. he's possessing the water or some shit. He's like, I'm gonna kill myself. But what about the other dude? This is so goofy. Just let him have him. He's his family's already dead. What? This nigga exploded in the water and just drowned. Right now we don't That's more excessive. Okay. But that was weird. Why? But why would they be after his father? Did his, what did his father do? Who is a very good swimmer, by the way. They keep saying this Need shit. Niggas who are good swimmers can die. They can get cramps. They can get the bends. Oh no, she's going to drown the tub. Not the mommy. Are you? 
And what have you done with my brother? Yeah. Shut up. Kid was acting kind of sus. Maybe if he just spit it out, just going like, uh, uh, uh. I'm sorry. He's I shouldn't be making fun of a, a fictional kid. He should say something. You and then the dookie water comes in. Okay, no, I have to pause for a second. Something stupid hap is happening. So, let's, okay, we're going to run it back 10 seconds. All right, so she's letting the water run on a tub that's already filled to the brim. She, okay, and she put the stopper at the bottom, so that means that new water is not being replaced, like it's not going out. So she is just, she's just basically letting the water overflow. Like, what are you doing? This is her fault regardless. She's just constantly letting the water overflow till it runs out on the floor. You, a fucking swamp water. The villain is Shrek. Stay out of my swamp. Dang, if you gotta rip her from the goddamn tub. It should have been Dean, but I mean grabbing her but we all float down here of course why do kids gotta be creepy bro like even after life like no nobody wants to play with your bum ass what are you doing Stop him! If you had the kid just walking. It's like, where are you going? It's like, why are you just walking out into the middle of nowhere? Or not in the middle of nowhere, but... A dead body. Oh, they're gonna find the... They found the bike. God knows where. So you can feel the same pain Peter's mom felt. And then after that, it's going to take you. And it's not going to stop until it does. Yeah. And how do you know that? Because that's exactly what it did to Bill Carlton. Listen to yourself. Both of you. You're insane. Daughter, you speak right up. You, think of us. you were literally drowned by nobody. We need to find Damn. 35 years? We were kids. He is now one with the I'm ocean so now, it or the so lake. Scary. My bad. This is Wisconsin. I say that I have anything to do with these drownings with Chris because of some ghost. You still fucking kill somebody. Stop trying to run this back. I would have more of a shocked response if I saw my kid go near the lake. It's fucking army, man. You can let it go. Peter. I'm Daddy, no. Peter. You think a little kid has any sort of, especially a kid ghost, has any understanding? Good, take his ass. He got to live a good 35 years, have wife, children, grandchildren, trade. Look at Dean looking like a full snack with the child in here. She better fuck the shit out of him after this. I'm sorry. It's part of my language. Look, we're not gonna say that he, to I don't care. He was a murderer. He kind of deserved that. A murderer that he gets to live 35 years after the fact that he killed somebody. Yo, these pe they be leaving people with knowledge that the supernatural exists. I would be, I'd never be able to sleep again. I'd be like, there's a ghost. There is a ghost in my house right now. Smash, smash, smash. That has been episode three of Supernatural. Uh, 
th- it was a lot better than the previous episode. Uh, we didn't get more plot progressing the story, but we got some more character moments with Dean. Uh, kind of like relate relating his PTSD for seeing his mother die to the kid who saw his father die by drowning. Uh, overall, I would give that episode a B plus. Uh, it has some good moments, good character moments. Uh, the monster of the week was just a ghost, a ghost, a ghost child who died in the water, which is fine. Uh, but overall, it was a really good episode. B plus. Uh, what did you guys think of this episode? Give it a rating down in the comment section down below early access on patreon for only five dollars and with that being said hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode see you guys next time peace